Hey, what's going on everybody? Jason here. Welcome to another Black Ops Cold War Zombies update video. Today, Treyarch posted another image on Instagram, and this is an autopsy of the brand new Zombies boss. So as we see here in the image, the species is unknown, and this document is dated the 11th of May, 1984, and the identification is Specimen K71924, and I think for short, I'm just going to call this thing K7. Subject is Specimen K71924, recovered from Dark Aether Dimension on the what looks like 9th of May, that's some pretty bad handwriting right there, 1984. Subject recovered by Minor Tobias Shank, subject was captured alive. And over here we got a pencil drawing of it, which this looks kind of creepy, not gonna lie. While caged, subject transforms into several common objects seemingly at will. Oh, so that explains the other teaser that we got where it looked like he was coming out of the bottle. This thing is a shapeshifter. It can transform into anything. Oh boy. Weight of subject changed based on the object it transformed into. Okay, very interesting. So we have a list of things it transformed into as well. A crate, equipment storage container, a chair, a rifle, and ethereum containment canister. So that's the tease that we saw. The little canister, he was popping out of it like he looked like a genie. And okay, that makes a lot more sense. This is definitely going to be very interesting, having a shape-shifting enemy in the new Zombies map. We're going to be playing Prop Hunt at the same time. We're going to be running away from zombies, and we're going to be shooting chairs and boxes and stuff, and we're going to make sure that's not an enemy, so that's going to be very interesting. Subject was terminated after escaping containment by taking form of rifle. Guard unwittingly opened cell, not realizing. So this thing's definitely very smart. It can, uh, it can outwit us humans and... Uh, escape by transforming into different items here. With additional research, we could potentially adapt creatures' camouflage ability for humans. Oh, well, that's, that's interesting. Warfare implications are massive, absolutely massive. If people can transform into chairs and rifles and I don't know, if anything else in their surroundings like a tree or a car or something, that would be, that would definitely change how warfare would work. Prior to termination, subject used prehensile tentacles to attack soldiers as it stormed through the base. And obviously those are the, the tentacles that we see on the back here, very similar to the Margwa tentacles. Tentacles appear to operate independently from arms and legs. Subject able to extend tentacle and grapple unsuspecting humans. So I think the tentacle is going to work like the Panzer's Claw in Origins where it's going to grab you and pull you in. So that's going to be very interesting. Upon termination, DNA is part human. Oh boy. <laughs> Disfigured face observed an autopsy report resembled that of Private Glasgow, MIA, last month in Dark Ether Dimension. So that's the human face that's on the back of this deformed creature. And uh, poor guy, he, he got transformed into this abomination. <laughs> Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. We got a little bit more information about the brand new Zombies boss coming with Firebase Z, and this thing is a shapeshifter. We have to keep a watchful eye out for anything out of place, whether it be rifles, boxes, chairs, or anything else in the environment. This is definitely going to be a very different gameplay mechanic when it comes to zombies because we haven't really had an enemy that camouflages into the environment like this. This boss is definitely going to be one of the more unique enemies that we face in Call of Duty Zombies. And what do you guys think about this? Let me know in the comments because this is definitely something very interesting. And I'm looking forward to seeing how this dynamic works next week on February 4th. Anyways, guys, that's it for this video, and I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit like and subscribe if you're a brand new viewer, and check out all the links down below in the description to stay up to date with everything that I do. And with that said, have a fantastic rest of your day or night, depending on where you are in this crazy world, and I'll see you guys next time.